Yo, what's going on guys? Nash for here. We are here at the Battery for another hockey challenge. Today we are doing the Hockey Triathlon, the Hockey Olympics. And yes, we are going to be using the Rapid Shot. If you saw my last video, we took on the Futuristic Hockey Trainer. A lot of you guys informed me it's actually been around for about 10 years, but it was new to us, the Rapid Shot. On the other side, there's something else that we're going to show you guys here today. Now it's time to work on our hands. So this is the Rapid Hands. It's essentially a high-tech super deaker that takes the same analytics that we had over there and applies it to our stick handling. So first I will show you guys what the Rapid Hands is all about. Then we will be doing a Hockey Olympics Challenge, me versus John's plan, where we have to go on a circuit. We do the Rapid Hands, we do the Rapid Shot, and then we have targets that we have to hit on the roller rink. First things first, just like the Rapid Shot, we do have our app, so we go ahead and scan on in here. There's going to be a number and a place that you have to look. So you have to keep your head up at all times, because we have to hit five of these. So we go ahead and stick in a little bit of this, five times, now we head over here. The biggest benefit I see with this over the Super Deaker is you have to keep your head up at all times. That's what a lot of people don't like about the Super Deaker. You're literally staring down at lights, just looking straight at the ground. With this, you have to look up, you have to evaluate the situation where you have to go, and how many stick handles you have to have in that spot. At the end, we get a score with how quick we're moving our hands, how quick our reaction time was, and how precise we were. So I'm gonna go ahead and set this up. We'll do one quick run, and then we will hop in to the Hockey Olympics. Let's go. All right, my first official attempt here with the rapid hands. Wish me luck. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, so there we have it. A final score of 163. We can see our hand speed, our precision. Let's go ahead and take a look at the stats. See each and every target that you hit and the color. As you go, it'll give you your hand speed and your precision. So not only how fast you got from target to target, but also how precise you were over the dots. And these dots, it's not like the Super Deaker where sometimes you can be like kind of far away and it gives it to you. This one, you have to go directly over and you get more points if you do get directly over. There's not really all that much else to this thing. It will save your progress over time, just like the rapid shot. So as we get better and as we improve, our score will increase and we can see how we improved. But now it is time to put this to the test. We're doing a little hockey triathlon with the rapid hands, the rapid shot, and the targets. Let's show you what we got. Today's main course is going to be a battle as old as time. It is me versus the man, the myth, the legend, John's plan. There will be three events in this race and it will be a time race. First, you're gonna come over and do 16 of the rapid hands. So go through, right once you do that 16, you then have to sprint over to the rapid shot. Now part of this is you have to come through, you have to get your phone out, you have to get that ready, you have to scan it, you have to hit enter. Your time does not stop moving at any point in this. So you start your event, again this is 16 shots, you have the 16 hands, 16 shots, for each shot that does not hit a color target so a white blank spot on the stat screen that is going to be plus one second to your time so you shoot all 16 of your shots you then come over here you're sprinting the entire time we're gonna be out of breath midway through this thing we have the roller hockey session so now we have 15 roller hockey pucks your goal is to hit the top left and top right target when you hit that top right target the time comes to a stop. Now obviously we probably have to give John a little bit of a handicap here, right? He's only been playing hockey six months, you guys know that. I think, what do you think's fair here, John? I'm saying 20 seconds, 30? I think, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I don't think 30's too bad, you know? I think my hands are gonna be much slower than yours and I'm definitely not gonna hit the targets as fast as you, so. 30 seconds, so he's gonna have a 30 second head start on me. Obviously, he has to hit both of these targets, which is going to be tough, and then plus one for each miss on the rapid shot. What do you think your chances are here? 30 seconds, that's a lot, so I feel like we'll be close, <laughs> but I'm pretty good at missing the rapid shot shots, so it's going to add a couple seconds, so we'll All see. Right. Now, it wouldn't be a competition if we didn't have a little something on the line. You guys know, every single video, we put the Timmies on the line. Well, today is a big one. There's a new Timmies that just opened up by us, and they're handing out $50 gift cards. That's what I heard. So, if I win this challenge, John's not only buying me Timmy's, he's also giving me his $50 gift card. And I will do the same for him. Let's hop on into this thing. Here we are at station number one. Now the thing to remember is John has 30 seconds on me. So I have to make up that time somewhere. So we gotta have the fastest hands, the quickest shots that we have ever had. All right, 
Here goes nothing. Wish me luck. One, two, and go. And we are officially off. We go one, two. Got to keep my heads up. Nice and quick handles. I'm trying to do a little bit extra at each one just to make sure that we get it before I move on to the next one. And it might be hurting me. And we are off. Here we go. This is what's most important. We have to get out our phone. We have to get the face ID. The face ID did not work with my mask on. And here we are. We have hit the begin button. Passes should be coming in two seconds. And they are one roller already. And we've already missed the net. We have to make sure that they don't roll up on us. Because again, it is a minus one for each puck that does not hit a target. So our focus is not necessarily speed, but just making sure that we hit the net as clean as possible. And we are doing just that. A couple pucks left. We do have, unfortunately, some missed nets in this mix. That's okay. I know that John is gonna be missing some more. And that is 16. Here we go. Top left, top right. A little low. No! There's one. There's two. Bang. 151.75, and you missed five shots. Okay, so 156.75 is our final time. Just under two minutes. I don't think that's a bad score, honestly. I could have definitely hit some more targets in the rapid shot. Some of them rolled up on me, and I tried to panic too much. The strategy is just go slow, take your time make sure you hit those targets. Actually, upon further review, it appears we have only missed one, two, three, four. John was trying to cheat me out of that second. You know that this is gonna be decided by one second as well. So my final time is 155.75. Now, it is this man's turn. Let's see what he's got in it. All right, here we go. John is officially off here on our first challenge. Now, the toughest thing I was struggling with is getting that puck to stay under control. He's doing a relatively good job of keeping it flat, which is obviously key. His hand speed may be a little bit slow. He's banking some off the boards. He's losing some time as we speak, but still, he's got a 30 second head start. He's got about three pucks left, and then he will be on his way, and I will give you guys a nice score update. And he is off. It looks like a time here currently of 34 seconds. Will he get a clean scan? That is crucial as well. He does get a clean scan. He double taps the enter button. He triple taps it on accident, but he does get back. And here we go. It is, oh my goodness. Do you believe in miracles? He has hit his first shot on the yellow. That one went wide. Again, it is plus one second for each shot that he misses. He has learned from my mistakes and is just taking his sweet old time on shooting these pucks. Good rips all around. He is, oh my gosh, he is absolutely sniping. The good news, he is actually getting blessed by that bottom left corner, three straight in the bottom left, and now the misses are beginning. That bottom left, he's being blessed! Again, these precious seconds are starting to add up just over the net. He's got about three shots remaining last shot of the challenge and he has missed it we are at one minute and 50 seconds oh my wait did you hit that he did <laughs> oh my gosh top left corner is hit we are just waiting for that top right bar down and out under the target and there it is the final time is two minutes and six seconds are you kidding? I'm out of breath. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I am telling you, this is one of the toughest challenges that we have done. Sprinting from bang to bang to bang. John has completed the challenge in two minutes. Now, if we go ahead and take a look at his misses, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven misses. So we add an additional seven seconds to that. So we have 206 plus seven. 213. <laughs> An absolute heartbreaking loss. It was just a little bit too much. So my final time was what, 156? His final time, two 
13. 30 seconds for me puts me at, wow, this is too much math along. I have taken a big L in this, what? <laughs> so John with his 30 second handicap is at a time of 143 to my 156. I would like to congratulate you on winning the first ever Hockey Olympics. How does Thank it feel? It feels great, but uh, I'm more excited for the Timmies, but you know, <laughs> it's a good feeling being an Asher. It's not very often on this channel, you see our boy John's plan come through with the W, but big ups to him. He has been out here grinding on this rapid shot. You can see his shot is getting better each and every time that we use it. But you know what, to end this video, John, I'm going to ask for one last opportunity. Can I have one more go? You can have one more chance. I know everyone here at the battery is gonna come in and try to beat this time, so I'm here to set a record, okay? This is going to be a world record attempt. My goal, 145. I think it's possible, I hit a 155. We're gonna to try to get 145 again with the added seconds. John, our boy is gonna be behind the camera. He told me He told me if I get 145, he's gonna buy me Timmy's like 10 times, so here we go. Uh, my goal for this one is just to hit all the targets, right? I don't care if I have to take some extra time at the rapid shot. I don't care if I have to you know, take my time on the roller hockey pucks. We're just gonna hit every target, make sure we get those out of the way. Here we go. We are off. There is no panic in us. And for the rapid hands. We're looking good so far. No mistakes. Stick handle right Oh my gosh, dude. That came fast! Here we go! Gotta make sure we get the can. We do have it. Pop, we're scared. Enter, enter, bang. Here we go. Okay. Ooh. Puck was a little bit delayed. I, it was caught off guard by it, but we have recovered. And now, no more misses. Let's play nice and slow. I'm not taking the fastest shots. I'm just making sure that we hit them accurately. Let's go, baby! Nice and smooth. Give me more of those bottom ones where we can just roll them into play. Let's go. Haven't missed one yet. For each puck that we missed, that one was debatable. It hit off the pipe. We did not get it. We're all good though. Two more shots. Separates us from a world record. There it is. Move. Here we go. Top left. No. No. Bang! Oh my gosh. My goal oh my for gosh. this one is just to hit all the targets. Oh my gosh! You're kidding! Oh my gosh, dude! Our final time. 146. I absolutely threw. What happened? Dude, I was getting rattled. There's a little bit of space between where the target is, and I hit that like three times. Absolute tragedy. Boys, I let you down, okay? We could have literally got away with like a, a 140 on this thing. But all in all, not a bad score for us. We end with that final time of 147 with the one missed shot that we have. Cannot at all be mad with that effort. Boys, I will be back, okay? This is not the end of me. We are gonna come back and we're gonna do this challenge again. I hope you guys did enjoy this challenge. Now I gotta go buy my boy John some Timbits. But if you guys did enjoy the video, make sure you hit the video with a like and let me know. Of course, hit that subscribe button. We are on the road to 1 million subscribers. We'll see you guys next time and peace.